And what's the song you're going to sing? Um, I'm going to sing Defying Gravity from <gasps> the musical Wicked. Oh, wow. <laughs> it's a hard song. OK, well, good luck. We are the 100 Voices of Gospel. And is it your choir? Well, actually, some say yes. Uh, I don't own them. You're the boss. Sort of. Okay. On, on the stage, I'm the boss. OK. And where are you all from? Actually, we are 20-plus nationalities. Nice. Mm. OK, so we're from all over. Uh, and you obviously are American. Yes, I'm American. We've got some English people in our choir as well. Oh, that's good. Can you hold your hands up? <laughs> there he is. Yeah. <laughs> well, he's the only one. 
Well, I, I only saw one hand. You saw one hand. The yeah. other two, they were not able to be with oh, okay. us. Okay, of course. Hang on, they live in England. Then why couldn't they come? <laughs> well, listen. Welcome, everyone. Thank you. Really good luck. I hope it goes well. Thank you. This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine oh, This little light of mine I'm gonna let it shine Everywhere I go Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Okay, let's go. to be my buzzer. <laughs> I'm so irritated <laughs> that this one got to that buzzer before me. Well, the thing is, you just got to act quick, and if you snooze, you lose. <laughs> I think this choir is incredible. Honestly, I feel elated. I felt so happy I couldn't get it out of me quick enough. And you were amazing. I just feel on, a, on an incredible high. I just wish I could be up there with you, clapping and singing. There are literally...
literally no words that I can actually use right now to describe that feeling that you gave everyone in this room. It is so powerful. Everything about you, everything you represent is my idea of heaven. And I am honestly so proud to have pressed the golden buzzer for an act that I believe Britain's Got Talent need and you have just blown the roof off. I, you are absolutely amazing. Absolutely brilliant. See in the studio. Well done. Brilliant. Love it. How are you? Fine, thank you, Simon. So who are you? I'm Ian, and this is my lovely wife, Anne. And what's your last name? Why is she lovely? No, I said, what's your last name? Oh, my last name, Marshall. I'm sorry. Oh, he's a bit thick. Don't listen to him. So, your husband and wife? We, we are. are. Okay, how many years have you been married for? Next Friday, 44 years. <laughs> Thank you. That is extraordinary. And your kids? Yeah, I've got four boys. Um, God. One's an active soldier at the moment. Oh, fantastic. Uh, uh, we were both soldiers when we met. Is that right? Yeah. Yes. Back in 1972, Ian and I met. Ian was a, a chef in the army, and I was in the Women's Royal Army Corps. We met on a Wednesday, and we were married the following Saturday. True. People said, it'll never last. But we're 44 years down the road. And it'll last till the end of our lives. And I, I adore her. And likewise, I love him more. I got you, babe. Our favourite thing is to go see our grandchildren. Yeah, that's what we love. We do everything together. Do everything. Hey, guys. Oh, sorry, did I interrupt? No, it's, no, it's all right. You just give me a bit of lip action. OK. We've come to Britain we've got time to win it, obviously. The song we're singing today is about us. About how we feel about each other, even after 44 years of marriage. And I love you. I love you more. OK, well, good luck. I hope you enjoy the song. Oh, 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 when you leave, I'm begging you not to go Call your name two, three times in a row Such a funny thing for me to try to explain I don't feel that my pride is the one I blame But I just don't understand How you love can do what no one else can Got me looking so crazy right now Your love's got me looking so crazy right now Got me looking so crazy right now Your touch got me looking so crazy right now Got me hoping you're crazy right now Your kids got me hoping you'll save me right now Looking so crazy your love
Relationship, and you picked a Beyonce song for no apparent reason. <laughs> for once, I, I just knew David was going to do that, but actually, for once, I get it. It's acts like you that make me love this show and love this country. Thank you so much, Simon. I love you too. Thank you, well, David. Feeling jealous now? Are you worried? I'm worried. Are you worried, you worried I'm going to win the whole thing? Oh, oh the the yeah. Yeah. Hello. What's your name? Um, my name is Jasmine Elcock. Jasmine, how old are you? Um, I've just turned 14 two days ago. Oh, happy Aww. birthday. Thank you. Who have you brought with you? Um, I've got my dad with me here today and my mum. Brilliant. Well, this is two minutes that could really change everything, so good Thank luck. Thank you very much. Thank you.
morsel. Oh, she deserved that. Oh, thank you, thank you. <laughs> you know what? I was at one point losing the will to live, thinking maybe all the talent has gone. And now you come back, little thing, with such a great voice, so charming. And let me tell you, I think this country is going to totally fall in love with you. For so many reasons, that audition moved me so much. I've never been this much of a mess on the show. Literally. Oh, my goodness. I hope all your dreams come true. You deserve it. You really do. We will see you in the studio for the live semi finals. You're straight through to the semis. Hello. <laughs> Who are you? Are you evil? Do you work for this Dark Lord? <laughs> Good luck! Dark Lord himself! <laughs> I 
Girls, I don't know who you are, but I literally said, if we could find stormtroopers who can dance, seriously, I said that, this show is gonna go into a different league. My dream has come true, thank you. I'm so glad that you were allowed to come onto this show and by the Darth Vader and audition for us because you were brilliant. You shone some light into this day. Well done. <laughs> I just love the fact that Simon went to me, I got the Stormtroopers. <laughs> that was brilliant. It was very refreshing and really happy for you. Well done. No surprise that the real life Darth Vader voted for his <laughs> troops. Um, it was brilliant, but I, I do worry that Simon Cowell may have lost his mind. <laughs> I don't care, but you know what? The dark side has taken over. Congratulations. <laughs> See you in the finals, guys. Well done, Simon. Well done. Well done, Simon. Well done.